Hello? What's um, up? And I'm, I'm actually in the middle of hosting this show, Who Said That Shit? And I gotta go because she thinks she's gonna get help that she's not gonna get. <laughs> Welcome to Who Said That Shit, a crazy fun in-studio game show where we highlight famous quotes from music, movies, and pop culture. I'm your host, Ryan Davis, comedian extraordinaire and pop culture expert. Here are the rules. Our celebrity guests will get 10 famous quotes from either music, movies, or pop culture. If they have trouble answering, then they'll get to use a lifeline. One of three lifelines, that is. That is one, phone a friend. Two, context before and after the quote. Or three, they'll get multiple choice. If they score less than five, they'll get a chance to get a bonus question worth two points. If their final score is four or less, then we're taking away their culture card. Gone, out of here, done. Score five or more, and they maintain it. Let's see if our guest has what it takes to win the day. Our guest today is a hit maker, artist, and songwriter. She's blessed Beyonce, Chris Brown, and even Hannah Montana with her lyrics. She is also one of our favorite cast members of Love & Hip Hop, Hollywood. Y'all, help me welcome Lyrica Anderson. Thank you for having me. You know, yeah. it's been a good year, even with the craziness or whatever. The craziness has slowed it down. This has been my um, super on fire year, aside from the show. I dropped a skincare line that's doing really well, um, Color Water Beauty. A lot of people know you from the show Love & Hip Hop. Mm -hmm. Will you be back? for next season? I don't know. Um, I'm trying to decide that still. So I'm really focused on the music, being a new mother, songwriting and stuff like that. So if it makes sense, then yeah. Okay. That's what, all right, so I know this game is a little difficult, so yeah. it is hard to. Are you ready? Yep. All right. When did you fall in love with hip hop? So that's the question to me. That's the quote. Yeah, I take a multiple choice on that. Multiple choice. A, Queen Latifah. B, Sanaa Lathan. C, Gabrielle Union, or D, Tracy Ellis Ross? <laughs> Freak, man, damn. <laughs> I'm gonna go with Queen Latifah. No. Oh! <laughs> it was Sanaa Lathan in the oh, movie Brown thing. Sugar. Oh that was the gosh. thing. When did you fall in love with hip hop? All right, focus, focus, okay. you gotta get with it. Breathe, All I right. got this, I got this. Next one. Okay. We ride together, we die together, bad marriage for life. Oh my God. You know. We ride together, we die together. Bad marriage for life? I've yes. never heard that before. I'm so mad at myself. You can do before and after. Okay, let's do that. So it's 25 years and counting. We ride together, we die together. Bad marriage for life. That's terrible. It's the truth. And this is a movie? No, nah, it's pop culture. Okay. I think married 25 years, recently, uh, <laughs> marriage was uh, part of the news a lot. Will Smith and Jada. See, it ain't that hard. Yeah! You put the together. <laughs> I didn't even tell you the answer. See? Okay, oh my God. Clues, Thank you. See, you gotta be my friend in this. Oh. I need a little guidance, a little blinker, turn left, turn right. You know, I need a little. Number three. I'm in my penthouse half naked. I cook this meal for you naked. Come on now, Beyonce. Oh, Beyonce, okay. Yes. Is there a reason why you know that lyric? Come on, man. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, they don't call me a songwriter for nothing. Oh, gosh. <laughs> You're absolutely right. Yeah. Absolutely right. Quote number four, you in it right now. All right, I'm in it. The name is mine. If she wanna go, she can go wherever she wanna go, but the name stays home. You can definitely phone a friend. I can't get an A and B too? You can definitely phone a friend. <laughs> do what you gotta do. All right, I'm gonna phone a friend. Hello. That's my best friend, Sia. Okay, Sia, we got a question, I'm stuck. All right, Sia. It's a lot on the line, her culture card. She'll be kicked out of the culture if you get this Oh, line. no. It's a possibility, it's, it's a lot on the line. This quote, who said this shit? The name is mine. If she wanna go, she can go wherever she wanna go, but the name stays home. Damn, I know who said that. Give her a, a B, uh, A, two. Can you give me, like, do I get multiple choice? <laughs> <laughs> That's why you know you're my best friend. All right, you talked me into it. I'll give you 
a multiple choice. Was it A, okay. Don Cheadle, B, Idris Elba, C, Lawrence Fishburne, or D, Tay Diggs? There you go. Woo! Get me in the concert! Yeah. Okay, go back. Love you. <laughs> yeah. She came through with the clutch Bye, for you. I love you. What's love got to do with it? Yes! <laughs> that name got my daddy blood on it. Quote five, you're doing well so far, I believe. Okay. All right, who said, bitch don't wear no shoes in my house? I give you before and after. Okay, okay, that's great. The line nice. before is, took it to the forest, put wood in the mouth. Bitch, don't put no shoes in my house. The private I'm flying in, I never want to fly again. Oh, that part. The part I'm flying in, I never want to fly again. There you go. <laughs> that part, hold on. Thugger. Oh, no, no, wait, no. no, no. Oh. You guessed it, wait. no. Oh, that was Roddy Rich, the box. Oh, and I love that song. Yo. Oh my God. Roddy, forgive me. Don't play with me. The way you sang it threw me off. You know, so we gonna blame you. I apologize. It's not even my song. <laughs> now we're at the midway point. Ooh. All right, five down, five quotes to go. Okay. How do you feeling? Nervous. You shouldn't be nervous. I don't nervous. even get nervous, like, but you got me like, damn, cause Roddy Rich, I, I, Oh, I'm you, still mad. You got a score of three though, three out of five. Okay, that's you, good. You do anything close to that and you keep your culture card, okay. all right? Okay, need my Two culture card. Two of the card. last five. I'm, I'm rooting for you. Quote number six. We don't know what she's doing in the bedroom. It could be like Halle Berry. Okay, I'm gonna phone my mom. Okay. <laughs> Cause dead ass, I don't even, I definitely don't know that one. Okay, let's see. There she is. <laughs> all right, mom. Lyrica needs your help. The quote that she's having trouble with is, we don't know what she's doing in the bedroom. It could be like Halle Berry. Who said that shit, Ma? Who said that shit? I swear to God, I don't know. Oh, no! Oh, no! I can't lose my coat. I can't lose my culture card. Hold on, you have to know. I don't know who said that shit. <laughs> okay, bye. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay. Oh, you gotta get, just guess, it's a person. Just guess a person. Oh, well, thanks. You could have said that. Denzel Washington. Close. Really close. Nah, not close at all. Actually, it was Lisa Ray. Oh, oh my gosh. Quote number seven, Marcus Darling, I don't have any panties on. <laughs> You're not gonna play with me. Okay, that's the movie where Eddie Murphy is trying to get, <laughs> no, I know this movie. I know the lady, oh my gosh, she's like trying to be funny. She's in his, she's, she, he wants the job and she, um, he thinks he has to sleep with her to get the job, and he does, but he didn't end up having to sleep with her to get that job. Wow. Right? You killing it. In a bad way? No, you doing your thing. Okay. I ain't wanna give you no more hints, but you obviously yes. know. <laughs> so I've seen that movie, so I need a little before and after, or a little more. Um, I can give you multiple choice. Okay. Was it A, Jennifer Lewis, B, Eartha Kitt, C, Loretta Devine, D, Taraji P. Henson. Eartha Kitt. That is correct. Ah, yay! Was, that's right. Okay. It was Eartha Kitt in the movie Boomerang, Lady Yes, Elise. I know that's on period. My, I got my that favorite. right. Quote number eight, anybody with a pet? Come on, you did a little something down there to make your dog feel good. Okay, I don't got that one, bro. Like, I feel like you playing with me. I feel like you 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 knew I was coming, so I feel like you gave me the harder questions. Uh, you wanna do before and after? I need something. See, that's how I know he's not a real animal lover. Cause anybody with a pet, come on, you did a little something down there to make the dog feel good. Well, you've never done it before. Can I phone you, Ryan? <laughs> I can't you phone me. <laughs> you want me? All right, you phone me. Go okay. ahead. <laughs> Hello? Hi, Ryan. Hey, Lyrica, I didn't even expect your call. Hey, what's um, up? And I'm, I'm actually in the middle of hosting this show, Who Said That Shit? And I gotta go because she thinks she's gonna get help that she's not gonna get. <laughs> 
insane. Uh, no, so it's Lyrica calling because then I don't got nobody else to call. <laughs> And I'm stuck. Can I get your help? But you're doing well. Just throw something in the air. You still got two more quotes to go. I don't know, shit. The baby. There you go. Just throw something out there. He used to rap. It was Joe Budden. <laughs> Man, damn. And I know Joe, but when he say that? Yo, he said that on his podcast. So we're moving on to quote number nine. If Twitter was out in 1961, I wonder what they would have said about Malcolm. This is a quote that somebody said. Yes. To somebody who's been criticized recently, wonder what they were saying about Malcolm X he's talking yes. about. I could go look on the shade room right Good luck. You know they post 93 things a day. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. Okay. They tweeted, I wonder what Malcolm X like. T.I. That's a great guess. That's a great, I can't even knock you. It was Ice Cube. Oh, but man, no, I mean, damn. that was a great guess. All right, this is the last quote, number 10. <sighs> reclaiming my time. When you are on my time, I can reclaim it. Bruh, damn, come on. Y'all know I'm a time. musician and a songwriter. Why y'all can't just stick to music? Like how you did Roddy Rich and Beyonce, and then we keep going, like things I would know. You got the phone somebody? Yeah. All right, <laughs> we can do that. Okay, this is my manager, so. That's Prince Howard, y'all. Uh, hey. Going on, man? Nine Man, we're here on the show Who Said That Shit. I just want to know, do you know who said this shit? And listen, I don't want you to be pressured or anything. It's nothing too serious. If you get it wrong, you know, Lyrica loses her culture card and gets kicked out of the culture. So it's, <laughs> so it's nothing big, nothing big. No, huge. no worries. Huge, yeah. yo, huge. All right, who said this? Reclaiming my time. When you are on my time, I can reclaim it. I'm reclaiming my time. I'm reclaiming my time. Dang. I'll, I'll give you multiple choice. Okay, you have to guess it right. Wait, 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 he's gonna get, he can't hear us. No, no, Prince, no, he's, give, he's right. He just got it right. <laughs> Yo, it was Maxi. Yo. Oh, shit. Now give him some props. I can't give him props, I heard him typing. He just Googled that. You didn't Google. No, I didn't. No, that's what it is. Oh, I'm about to say, wait, 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 no, no, no. I really appreciate you because I never would have got that right. She was about to be gone. So you've reached the total of five. Hey. Your culture card is maintained. Yes, thank you. You almost went into the bonus and now I'm curious as to whether you would have got it or not. Uh -huh. Do you want to do the bonus? Oh, it depends. Is it about it's music? It's not going to take nothing away from your score. You have maintained your culture card. You are safe. This is 100% for fun. This is a great one. I don't trust you, Ryan. I'm telling you, That's this is a, a trick. great one. Nah, I, I believe in you with this one. All right, come on. All right, I hate to say it, and I hope I don't sound ridiculous, but I don't know who this man is. Sorry to this man. Kiki Palmer! <laughs> That's my girl! Oh, see, <laughs> Yay! I knew you were going. I knew <laughs> you knew it. High five. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. And with a total score of seven, once we add the two bonus, Lyrica maintains her culture card. Period. Lyrica, let them know where you can find everything Lyrica. Y'all can follow me on Instagram at Lyrica Anderson, which is also all my socials. You can follow me on TikTok, Real Lyrica Anderson, and make sure y'all get my new album, Bad Hair Day. Okay, this was another amazing edition of Who Said That Shit. We had a lot of fun. And remember, no matter who said it, we read it. Until next time, I'm Ryan Davis, peace out.